हेलो वेलकम टू माय चैनल इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई मेड अ प्रोग्राम ऑन एरेस मल्टी डायमेंशनल एरेस तो दिस इज थ्री डी मैट्रिक्स थ्री डी मैट्रिक्स इन मल्टी डायमेंशनल एरे सो लेट्स मेक अनदर प्रोग्राम एंड टुडे वी विल डू अ कोडिंग फॉर रिगार्डिंग फॉर अर्थमेटिक ऑपरेटर्स सो लेट्स स्टार्ट java class basic basic math and save it and we can remove this because there is no use of this in arithmetic opera operators uh, the basic maths is my subtraction addition division multiplication so we will do in uh, integer and doubles so let's start int so we are using int 5 times to so five basic math operators so let's copy and paste what i am advising you to don't copy paste i am doing to save your time it is we need 5 so we are it's showing error because we are not completed Code. When we are we write whole code, it will these errors are removed. So we are initializing these variables. So a. We are doing here addition. And here we can do multiplication. And then division and then subtraction. we are taking negative so let's try print it for print we are using system dot out print ln Oh, 
Here's the statement public static. void main string args so system dot print ln so we are printing here Whatever you write here, it will print in, show in output, it's like any other programming language. Or yeah, we are doing a value of e. So we have to write here five statement of print. So here is A and then So best part of NetBeans is that the all errors are or suggestions are here. So you don't need to worry about your errors. So we will print here. Doubles also. So arithmetic using doubles. So let's see here. We are commenting here arithmetic using doubles. So let's start here. And what is the problem? So now system dot on printing again here floating point arithmetic here we will write here. floating point arithmetic. this and this so double now we are using here double d4 here is double means double so same same is here but only the difference is here we are using in instead of int here is double or no difference
here we can da into d into three. Then db slash db divided by four. Here dc minus doubles doubles. Then here is minus. I don't know where sh why we are showing error. We is everything the same? Don't know. Let's see. Then system dot out print Alan. So our program is now complete. So let's see the output. So now showing no error here. Oh, then it's good. So let's save this and I'm deleting this program. And this okay. So let's run this program and a program is successful build successful so here it is uh, here is our int so it's print, printed here 1 plus 1 is 2 and a multiplied by 3 is 6 and here is floating point arithmetic numbers so this program is successful and output is here so let's go to another program and this program on modulus operator it is very small one so let's start new file java class and here we are naming it modulus modulus and so here is your class modulus i'm deleting this And this one also so we can get more space here so 
फर्स्ट इज पब्लिक स्टैटिक वॉइड मेन पब्लिक स्टैटिक वॉइड मेन एंड स्ट्रिंग ए आर जी एस एंड हेयर इज ब्रैक start the program here is we are taking in integer and variable x and we are initializing it by 42 then double is y so double for double and we are initializing with 42.25 so let's print the statement system dot out dot print ln so what do you want we write here it will print so modulus for mod x here is for modulus we are writing here only mod in short form and x mod 10 is equals to 10 find some Don't forget. And for double, we have to write it again. So here is y mod. And everything same. Only we are remove x. I'm putting here y. So our program is now done. So let's save it. And now I'm running this program. So let's run this. So our program is successful. Run. Here is x mod ten is equals to two. And y modulus ten is two point twenty five. So this is showing a remainder. Okay. So let's do one another program, and this is this is several assignment operators. So let's do it again. And. I'm taking a new Java class, and its name I am taking here. Name is op equals. is a program and here same i'm removing this and this one also then first step is a public static void main void main if you practice the uh, 3 to 4 or 5 program then you can learn all this so oh semicolon no semicolon here so let's do it 
int and we are taking variable we will take variable a and initializing with the values here is one you can take any values and here is c and we are taking three now a plus equals to five then b plus position equals to four then c to a into b then c modulus equals to 6 so put in a line Now we are going to print all this. It's showing error. So let's see what is the problem here. We don't need to write here plus because we are showing here. We are doing multiplication. So let's try system dot print ln for printing. So here we are writing A, same as here. So I am copying this. we have to print a b c so let's do it fastly one is So our program is now completed. So uh, let's run this program. First, I'm saving this. And now running this program. So our program is successful and here is showing number A is 6, B 8 and these are so you can see here output of program and it is showing there it is total time taken to and the finished all everything is here which is not in other languages. So let's do one and one more program and which is for increment.
or decrement we will do increment and decrement in our next video because video is getting too long so let's go and upload i am uploading all these program on my github you can go and see there if you are implement you're writing a code or you have any problem so you can download the code and see what is the correct so let's go to my github account it's taking time because when you are down when you are using netbeans on your computer or laptop it makes slow everything or there is a net problem or oh it's taking time this is my youtube channel you can go and find out the videos of java data structure stats statistical computing numerical computing java it's a java script tutorial so here are the playlist you can go to my playlist and see anything any videos here and these are videos of oh my and today i will upload java tutorial number 8 with you this one is number 9 so let's add my files here i'm uploading the file from my laptop so so my programs are saved in on desktop let's go to desktop oh document it's over to here oh where are the programs i'm not able to it's not showing anything what's the problem uh oh where are my programs saving go to c so i'm uploading all the files on github you can go and see there video is going long taking long times